today's video we're going to look at the evidence behind L-theanine for anxiety, sleep and mental alertness. Let's get into it. L-theanine is an amino acid found mainly in tea leaves, particularly green and black tea. It crosses the blood-brain barrier and works in a number of ways. It increases the levels of GABA, dopamine and serotonin, which are the chemicals that help you to relax and feel good. L-theanine structurally resembles glutamate, competes with the same receptors and in turn calms the brain's excitatory signals. L-theanine promotes alpha brainwave activity, which can help with relaxation and your mental state. And it reduces cortisol levels, oxidative stress and inflammation. Due to its ability to increase GABA, dopamine and serotonin in our bodies, L-theanine can improve anxiety and depression. In this double-blind randomised control trial, 30 patients were given L-theanine for 4 weeks. Anxiety and depression significantly improved in those taking L-theanine compared to the placebo group. People taking L-theanine under stress have been found to have reduced biomarkers of stress such as heart rate and salivary immunoglobulin A. The dosage to take for anxiety and depression is 100 to 200 mg per day. L-theanine improves alpha brainwave activity, which can enhance concentration and learning. In this study on 69 older Japanese men and women, half of the group were given L-theanine and a half given the placebo. They then did a variety of cognitive tests to test things like verbal memory, visual memory, reaction times and non-verbal reasoning. What they found was even a single dose of L-theanine taken 50 minutes before the test showed improved reaction times, increased number of correct answers and reduced number of omission errors. This shows an improvement in working working memory and executive function. Previous studies have found there to be a synergistic effect on attention and memory when taking L-theanine combined with caffeine. So to get the best effect, take 100 mg of L-theanine with 40 mg of caffeine 50 minutes before your test. L-theanine appears to improve sleep, particularly in those with anxiety-related sleep disturbances. It doesn't make you drowsy like a sedative, but instead helps to relax and calm your mind. A review of 18 studies found L-theanine helps you to fall asleep quicker, reduces daytime drowsiness, and improves sleep quality. The benefits were seen in those with schizophrenia, depression, anxiety, and also in those with no other medical conditions. L-theanine also helped to improve sleep in boys aged 8 to 12 with ADHD. The dosage to improve sleep is 200 to 400 milligram per day. Some people have found that it works on lower doses so you can start on 100 milligram per day and increase from there to see if it helps. Take it 30 to 60 minutes before bedtime. Early animal and lab studies have found that L-theanine may be useful in asthma and neurodegenerative disorders such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease due to its anti-inflammatory and antioxidant effects. The standard dosage is between 100 to 400 mg per day and it's safe to take for up to 8 weeks. Higher doses of up to 900 mg per day have also been found to be safe. L-theanine can be taken with or without food, however if you want it to work quicker then take it on an empty stomach. The form I'd recommend to use is suntheanine, which is a patented pure form of L-theanine. This is the form used in most studies. L-theanine is generally considered safe to use. It rarely may cause some side effects such as dizziness, headaches and stomach upset. There is no known toxicity. There are no known interactions with other medications. However, be careful if you're taking blood pressure medication as L-theanine may potentially reduce your blood pressure. If you're taking any medications that cause drowsiness, L-theanine theoretically may cause more drowsiness. You can get L-theanine from your diet in teas such as green tea, black tea, oolong tea and white tea. You can also get it in small amounts from certain mushrooms such as the Boletus badius mushroom. Here is how much L-theanine you'll find in these sources. So that comes to the end of the video. If you found this video useful, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye!